Hey folks, it's Josh Stony Ridge Farmer. Welcome to the farm vlog today. We're gonna take the manure spreader here and I'm gonna teach you how it works, show you how it works, and we're gonna get this big pile of butt fertilizer up. We're gonna put it in the manure spreader and we're gonna take it down on some new spots where we just sowed grass probably six months ago and it needs a little more nutrient in the soil. So we're gonna take our old Massey Ferguson 240 tractor, load up some poopy with the skid loader and go have some fun. All right? I've been running around this farm just chasing them chickens that are running along. All right, folks, so you may have never seen one of these. This is a manure spreader. I'm gonna say it's probably 60 years old, maybe older than that. It's a geriatric manure spreader. So therefore, we can't really load it up too heavy with really, really wet manure. But what it does, basically, there's a set of chains on here that runs around and around, and I engage it with these handles right here. So once we get to the place where we're gonna go, I'll engage it, these chains will move, and there's a little piece of metal that slowly pushes the manure out of the back of the manure spreader. Now, it's got some weird looking stuff on the back that look like teeth. Let me show you those. Okay, so these weird looking dudes right here that look like teeth are actually for grabbing, and they'll grab like that clump of grass right there, they'll grab it and pull it back through here, and if it's a huge clump, they'll smack these paddles, and these paddles are spinning at a really high rate, and it'll just go, bah, just splash it out all over everywhere we're gonna work. Now, I have never used this manure spreader, so we're all in for a surprise. This is one big, bunch of manure and this is horse manure that we did a little bit of trading for so first thing we're going to do we're going to fire up the old 240 tractor here and this tractor is super duper pretty and clean we're going to fire it up we're going to take it down to where we need a little bit of manure on the soil and then we'll engage those handles right there and see it at work all right if you've never been on a tractor there's a few things you need to know there are two gear shifters down here this one should be in neutral and this one should be in the S position. So there is a low, a high, and a start right in the center. So we're in start, our brake is set, our kill switch is pushed in, our clutch is down, and now we'll start the tractor. Over and over and over again, I will tell you to make sure your butt is firmly planted in this seat. This is the most dangerous place on the farm. In between, this front tire and that back tire with your hand reaching in here to start that key. That will kill you. Be smart. If there's one thing you learned today, make it that. Let's get busy. All right, we're gonna go two, low, break off, clutch out. There we go. Now you can see the manure spreader behind me. I won't be able to talk to you a whole lot as I'm spreading, but I'll try my best. We're gonna set the camera up and we're also gonna throw the drone up in the air and let you get some aerial shots of what's going on with this thing. I sure hope it works as good as I think it will, but we'll see. I've never used it. Pretty fun though. That's a thousand dollar piece of old farm machinery right there. Thousand bucks, crazy. Let's go have fun. Guys, be sure and take the time to hit that like button, okay? Thanks a lot. Guys, in order to operate the manure spreader, there are two handles. This handle right here engages the manure spreader, and this handle right here is the speed of the manure spreader. So the further down I go with this handle, the faster it goes. And we want it to go fast, so we'll go all the way down with that handle, and then we'll engage it with this handle. I'll show you. So you squeeze right here. This little guy raises a pin in here. You slide him down, and he goes into a hole. Right there. And then that big old pile of manure right there gets kicked out of the back. It's really fun to watch this thing work, but it's hard to film. 
I wish I had a GoPro mounted right there so you could see it kicking it, but we'll do our best. Guys, this is the first truly documented case of a <laughs> DJI Mavic Pro going through a manure spreader. <laughs> Whatever it takes to get the shot, baby. <laughs> Well, folks, I hope you found this entertaining. We're going to continue to work here. We've got probably five more loads of manure to spread. And you can see down through here, the soil is just baked, basically. It's like the surface of Mars. So I really just need to get some biomass in there, some substance in there, some nutrient in that soil. And it used to be an embankment right here, and we smoothed all this out and cleared all this land. So that's what I'm doing. That's the rest of the day. I may get you a little more footage, but I won't get you any more drone footage. At the end of the video, I'll show you the drone going through the manure spreader again. That's got to be a first. I've got to send that in to DJI. That was completely crazy. I have crashed that drone, I know, 10 times. I put it back together, I fix it, I fly it, I crash it. It doesn't have enough sensors on it, so it should have sensed like, hey, I'm getting close to something crazy. <laughs> but it just went <laughs> Guys, thanks a lot. Please click that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave me some comments, and tell me what you're thinking, okay? I appreciate you. Come on back and see us on the Stony Ridge Farm. I wanted to show you how the manure spreader worked, and it works pretty good. So we're going to have some more fun, sling some more manure for a few more hours before the sun sets here on beautiful Appalachia. Thanks, guys. See you next time. Woo! Well, come on down to the Stony Ridge. Bring your wife and bring your